Waz is going to say, because you know me, I'm a little bit, I'm a little fairly annoyed at Ta-Nehisi and me and Boshgar did yeah. the kind of intellectual version of the critique of him a couple weeks ago. But but we, but we, you and I also talked about how on the fourth or fifth episode of this show, you came on, you were in studio, and you basically just laid out the white people are trash brief, which as you already pointed out, like I already know, this is not new news to me. <laughs> Uh, but you, you basically made the case that Ta-Nehisi made, in my view, not as well as you did in that article, The First White President. So I teased it. I said, Waz is going to say what Ta-Nehisi will write in a couple of weeks, but in a more entertaining way. So I want to line you up before you, before you sign off. And of course, first you got to disagree with everything that I said and probably say what a great writer Ta-Nehisi is. But... After you do that, what's the, like, whether it's Popovich taking Trump on or just Trump in general, I just want in the last couple of minutes, last week, Mike Hanna, of all people, did the proper, every week we got to get a Trump fucking tear apart. And I need you to do that this week in all sincerity, because fuck him. Look, dude, it, it, it. The best part about Trump is, in, I'm tired of the word hypocrisy, but it's not, it's not even hypocrisy to me. It's about priorities, right? It's mm. about fits a, a fucking football player who wields no influence anywhere outside of football and maybe supporting the people around him, sits down during an anthem, causes a shitstorm. Right. This guy... <laughs> this guy calls the widow of a fallen soldier, who again, all I hear from white people in their white tears about the fucking flag <laughs> is, is, yo, you can't disrespect the truth. The soldiers. They paid the ultimate sacrifice, yo. This, come on, the truth is beyond reproach. Boom, fine, cool. This well, you know what I always say. You know what I widow. say, was. You know what I say. They knew what they were getting into. <laughs> exactly. So, Did you so, so these? now, Michael, and I know, yes. dude, Michael, and I that know was a joke, by the way. Much. Sorry, go ahead. Yeah, I know we do this too much. We do the yo, um, what if liberals were fucking doing this, right? Yes. Just imagine President Obama called the wife of a slain police officer and said. But he knew what he was signing up. Dude, you are right? listen, You clearly are behind on the show, bro. You're behind on the show. Was happened last week, dude. It went, it went something like God. this. But again, it's just it it's went just something like, like, uh, like yo, I have a two o'clock with Kendrick it. Lamar. Sorry, your kid's dead. Right. Exactly. <laughs> right, like, exactly. You just couldn't even fucking imagine this shit. Right. You like right. you couldn't even imagine it, and it's like nobody's gonna care. You know what I'm saying? It's just the priorities are weird. It's like the priorities are liberal. Shut the fuck up and eat this medicine. Right. Rather than, yo, fam, the, yo, he just tweeted. He said he had a great conference with the, um, the, the, C, the GOP Senate. And he said, I got a lot of standing the ovation. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> like, what? That's not important. Like, what? Like, oh, man, it's, it's so... And again, and you know, and shout to Tana Hisi again. And I, when I talked to Michael Brooks, and he's, you know, he's a Tana Hisi skeptic, but I said, yo, at the end of the day, there's somebody in the Atlantic magazine who will step up and say, white people are trash. They're trash. <laughs> just my God. Like, let's, let's just sit back and just, like, people, white people will stand up and just, like, there is no black version of this, right? Like, there are black people who stand up and say, yo, Farrakhan, man, like that will just die, like loving Farrakhan. Where like 35% of black people would just be like, yo, this guy's great. No matter what he says, what he does, how over the top he is, how ridiculous it is. Like there's just no, ver there's no other version of this shit. Hi folks, Sam Cedar here. We still need your help on our Patreon page. YouTube abs have come back, but not nearly as much as we had before. So if you can help us out, any little bit helps. Head over to our Patreon page right at this URL, and you'll help us keep helping you by making videos.